Hey guys, welcome back to Life with Liz. If you haven't already, make sure to subscribe to my channel, turn on your post notifications, that way you'll be notified every time your girl posts a new video. Hey guys, I am Art Wanted Pozole today for dinner, so I am in the process of making pozole. I have a pot going already with uh, the pig's feet, garlic, onion, water, and salt. Oh, and a uh, uh, couple of neck bones, pork neck bones. Um, so I'm about to cut up this meat and get the chiles going. So let me get started on that. All right, guys, so I finished cutting up the meat. So I've got that here. And now I am just destemming some chiles so that I can boil them up, soften them up, and blend them for the, for the sauce. And I'll show you guys what kind of chile I'm using. I'm using chile guajillo. That is the chile that I'm using. So just taking off the stems. I'm using about 20 chiles. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and add water to this and get this going. All right, so I've got the chiles going. Those are on already. I'm going to add the meat into the pot here. I won't be able to show you guys because I don't want to get burned, but just the pig's feet are basically starting to kind of pull apart a little bit. So I'm going to go ahead and add the meat in there. this up and then just wait for the chiles so I can make the sauce and then I'm gonna throw the sauce in here along with the hominy so just give this a little while I'll be back all right so my chiles are done so I'm gonna start adding them to my blender and in my blender I have about half a little more than half of a large onion and uh, three garlic cloves so I'm gonna blend all of this together I'm going to add my chiles in here and then I'll also add some of this water that I use to boil the chiles with. And then I also do like to strain the chile. I don't want any big pieces in there so I do strain it. So let me go ahead and get this blended and then I'll be back. All right, guys, the chili is done, so I'm going to go ahead and strain it. Just, I'm closing it. But just putting it in here. Get any of the seeds, pulp, all of that stuff out of there. And then just have the, the sauce. So once I'm done with this, I'll go ahead and add it into the pot as well. So I'll be back. All right, chile is now strained and it is going in the big pot. I don't know if you guys can see it, but I can't. I need both hands. All right, so for now, this is what it's looking like. I'm going to start opening up the I'm gonna, I'm gonna wait for the meat to get a little softer and then I'm gonna go ahead and start opening up the hominy to add it in here. All right, so it's about that time. I'm gonna go ahead and add my hominy in. this up I'm checking to see if maybe it needs uh, more hominy but I think it's I think it's good with that so now I'm just gonna let it boil a while longer and then we'll be ready to eat 
All right, guys, the pozole is almost done, so I'm going to start cutting everything up. I do have limes cut up. I'm cutting up the cabbage. I have radishes, onion. I have some serranos here. I don't know how many of those I'll cut up or if I'll even cut those up, but serranos and some avocados. So I'm just going to chop all of this stuff up. I'll be back. All right, guys, pozole is done. Ooh, got too close. As you can see, it is boiling. I'm just letting it finish up. It's it's done. I'm just keeping it hot, but I'm warming up tortillas. So as I'm warming them up, I'm still letting it finish up. But just gonna warm up tortillas, and we're about to eat. All right, guys, pozole is done. This is Miss Gabby's bowl. This is Miss Gingy's bowl. We got some avocado, cabbage, radishes, onion, the limes. <laughs> Uh, red pepper flakes and oregano. So Gingy's about to doctor hers up. I'm gonna doctor Gabby's up and I would eat it, but there's steam coming out. Huh? I said I would be eating it, but there's a steam coming out already. <laughs> it's still too hot. Okay. Yeah, there is steam still coming out of it. <laughs> All right, and here's Art's plate. He's doctoring that sucker up. It's a lot of pig's feet there, buddy. <laughs> Uh, here's mine. I'm about to doctor mine up right now, too. It's as you guys can tell, it's still pretty, pretty hot. So that's about the smallest bowl I'm gonna, or pozole I've ever seen. You well, make. I'm gonna start with this yeah, if I can yeah. finish it and then don't try to fake the funk. Uh... <laughs> whatever, whatever. Don't be a hater. <coughs> How is it, Miss Gabby? Mm. Awesome. Mm. All right, guys, I'm about to try this out. See how it is besides scorching hot. Mm. Bomb baby. Bomb. How is it? You liked it? The man over here was the one craving it. That's why that's why we made it. I love it. Uh, we is a lot of people, that's why I made it. Huh? That's why I made it. What do you mean we? I mean you. Yes, yeah, so that's right. What what do I mean we? <laughs> we is a lot of people. Girl, I brown the rice. There's no rice. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. We're going to finish eating. This guy's delirious. We'll be back. <laughs> hey, guys. So the pozole was um, a great pick. It was so good. Uh, Kaylin called. She came. She ate. I didn't vlog her eating. She came. She ate, um, she said it was really good. She said it was worth the drive. <laughs> so she came in from Bakersfield. She was studying, but when she heard Pozole, she was like, all right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go. <laughs> so she was here, she came, she ate, and she was here for a little bit. She spent the night. She did spend the night. And then uh, we had Pozole again in the morning because it was, it was that good. It was really good. Uh, my parents came by in the morning and uh, took some, because I called them the night before and I was like, hey, come and eat in the morning uh, some pozole uh, or come and get some that way you guys can eat I called my mom and it was like 8 o'clock in the morning she was like oh I completely forgot your dad's already making breakfast <laughs> so they did come though and they picked some pozole up and they took it and they had it uh, they had it for dinner and my dad my dad told me he goes the pozole was really good and my dad coming from my dad I take it as a big compliment so uh, he said it was it was really good it was really good so <clears throat> I'm happy I'm happy that made me happy uh, and I'm not gonna lie it was good it was really good uh, I had a I had my bowl and then probably had a little bit more later on and then the next day in the morning I I had a big bowl it was it was good uh, Gabby ate a lot of it too she I'm glad that she's not picky and she likes all that stuff um, but yeah it, it's Pozole and menudo, they're they are easy to make. They're just very time-consuming. They're very time-consuming, but they are worth the wait. Very worth the wait. <laughs> we did have pozole left over, so I ended up um, bagging it up and freezing it for a rainy day. So, pozole does not go to waste here. But pozole and menudo do not go to waste here. <laughs> but yeah, it was delicious. I'm glad Caitlin came. I'm glad my parents came. And we all enjoyed it. But that does conclude today's video. Make sure to comment, like, share, and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Thanks for watching, guys. Till next time.